Just wanted to ask a question about employment for people with disabilities. Mm -hmm. I know we talked about the unemployment rate much higher amongst that population. Uh, I know there's some legislation that we passed and some programs. Uh, just wanted to get your feedback on the progress we're making and what more we can do perhaps in this state budget and maybe through legislation in the rest of the session. Uh, I have a son who's 22 and uh, you know, perhaps with a job coach and uh, some other things, you know, he may be looking into this as well. As many, many people come to my office ask the same thing, how can we uh, open up these employment opportunities? And I, I will say that I have seen more in the past few years because there is a workforce shortage and people are looking, uh, mm -hmm. private companies are looking to hire. Uh, just wanted to get some feedback on what's happening with your department. So as I said, we do have adaptive technology in all of our <clears throat> career centers, and we have career counselors trained to work with you know people in various with various barriers, including disabilities. Um, and we work very closely with, of course, the the not for profits and the schools and all the other support systems in the state. It's a very broad, as you know, I'm sure, a very broad group of support, and we're part of it. We really believe that anybody who can work should work. And we support that wholeheartedly. I have had wonderful conversations with Kim Hill about it because it is, it's actually a very meaningful thing for me as well. And, and anything we can do to, to be more accessible, to be more um, engaged as a partner, we will do it. Because our job really is to help people find work, whatever that work may be. And if, and if I may jump yeah, in, and, and so um, from a state, um, aspect working with Chief Disability Officer uh, Kim Hill. She's held her second dream event where we, where we talk about opportunities for individuals with disabilities to enter into the workforce. So I think it's about education, um, about the opportunities and, and making sure state agencies are aware that we have a, a population that is ready to work. And then there was another thing that, that came through one of the dream events is Special Olympics came. Yes. And we, part, we, we, had so, we had a great time with them. And then I followed up with them and I was able to go to one of their opening ceremonies and talk about the opportunities that are available in state government. So it's looking at opportunities for marketing and getting that word out through partnerships we may have not thought about in the past. And so I, I, I think we're moving in the right direction. That's great to hear. Um, and just